You may travel far and wide but never will you find the boundaries of the soul. The universal cosmic process was not created by any god or man. To God all things are beautiful, good, and right, human beings, on the other hand, deem some things right and others wrong. It would not be better if things happen to people just as they wish. And some men are as ignorant of what they do when awake as they are forgetful of what they do when asleep. To be event-minded is the greatest virtue. Wisdom is to speak the truth and act in keeping with its nature. It is wise to agree that all things are one. Under the comb, the tangle and the straight path are the same. There is nothing permanent in the world except change. The cosmos was not made by gods but always was and is eternal fire. There is nothing permanent except change. Therefore enjoy what good you have while you have it and endure and outlast what bad you can't cure immediately. All men have the capacity of knowing themselves and acting with moderation. There is a stability in the universe because of the orderly and balanced process of change, the same measure coming out as going in as if reality were a huge fire that inhaled and exhaled equal amounts. Men that love wisdom must be acquainted with very many things indeed. Man is on earth as in an egg. Those unmindful when they hear, for all they make of their intelligence, may be regarded as the walking dead. The unexpected connection is more powerful than one that is obvious. No same man could walk through the same river twice, as the men in the river have since changed. For those who are awake, the cosmos is one. Couples are holes and not holes, what agrees disagrees, the concordant is discordant from all things one and from one all things. Even a soul submerged in sleep, is hard at work and helps, make something of the world.